Hello everyone and welcome to this week's auction, Saturday, March 19th, video preview with Sound Auction Service. Um, let's get right into it. We have this beautiful new digital LG double door refrigerator, um, Kenmore stackable washer and dryer, can also not be stacked, it's front load. We have paper shredder. This glass top, modern computer desk, Casio, this Casio keyboard here with cover. We have Samsung LCD 40 inch TV, some a mirror there, a round mirror with me in it, <laughs> artwork, <clears throat> some medals. We have this embroidered queen size comforter with throw pillows um, this Technics stereo home system stereo system with a Sony receiver and Pioneer disc changer let's see we have the Singer 401A sewing machine with the cover and the sewing table that it sits in the table folds up very nice we have this full-size bed frame, some original artwork right there. I like this Asian one. That's pretty cool. Corey's right. I did. I do like that. <laughs> have this leaded glass. What are those irises? Um, some nice ornately framed home decor there. We have this glass top and wooden sofa table with this antique window decor um, John Deere 14 PZ mower there lawn mower got this uh, rustic lawn furniture padded this mid-century coffee table there we have this nice, this thing is very nice, power trim, edger, um, this rustic log stand, pedestal stand. We have some concrete yard art, this Rubbermaid, is it Rubbermaid? Suncast garden cart. This thing's nice. The Grill Master. Very cool. Works good. The little electronic igniter works also. Sparks right up with the side burner there. <clears throat> and it does have a propane tank with it. See right there. Then we have this propane tank here and it's full. And then we got this Lodge Hibachi Grill cast iron. And this is pretty cool. This craft si Craftsman 16-inch um, electric chainsaw. Some Craftsman screwdrivers and others. Little portable grill, charcoal grill there. And this looks like a um, what kind of power cord? A generator power cord. Then we have this Ryobi trimmer, and it's got a metal metal attachment on there, metal blade. And we have this Craftsman 16 gallon wet dry vac. Some clear outdoor umbrellas. Looks like there's approximately eight or 10 there. This utility, shop utility shelf. Looks like holds tools and shelving. Then we're gonna have all these yard tools also. A bunch of great yard tools. And then we have this Warner telescoping multi-function ladder <clears throat> um, this metal cart here or organizing cart this a cute little watering can we have these driftwood shelves these are really cool I really like those and then we have, oh man, this stuff's nice. This is all Fostoria glass. 
bunch of different pieces. We have salad plates, dinner plates, cups, bowls, saucers, <clears throat> candle holders, candle holders, salt and pepper shakers, butter dish, pedestal dish, candy dish, cream, sugar, toothpick, gravy boat, serving bowls, sectional bowls, serving platter, water pitcher, serving pedestal foot boulder, beautiful cake plate right there. This is, we have like an hors d'oeuvre tray, another console bowl or serving bowl. Very nice collection, very nice. And then over here, we have all this Mary Inglebright. Let's see, we got cream and sugars and butter dishes and teacups and plates and vases, coffee cups, more Mary Inglebright plates and bowls. And then we have this frosted stemware, Raggedy Ann and Andy doll frosted tumblers. Let me come around here. We have this nice necklace holder here. Some pedestal candle holders. Cute little dresser. And then if you ever wanted a bell, we've got it. We have a huge bell collection from little miniature ones to metal ones to glass ones to hand painted ones to porcelain ones to ceramic ones to pottery ones. You name it copper ones very nice collection and a beautiful decanter <laughs> then we have some old 1950s GB bears and I like this <laughs> these uh, colorful Pyrex bowls beautiful and excellent condition nesting Pyrex bowls and then we have this art glass basket or base then we have some carnival glass there, this old railroad or miner's lamp, this brass uh, globe, and it's got a compass on it, some nice fiesta ware, serving spoons, a little pitcher and plate. <clears throat> and we have these small plastic animal figurines, large collection, Nikon Travelite binoculars, we have the Poppin' Fresh Doughboy, KitchenAid can opener. That's mine, I'm still getting that. And then we have the Mariner's Ticket Stubs, this very nice leaded glass music box. And we have the little pot of gold with the gold dollar coins in there. <laughs> it's cool, it's cute. And then we have this alabaster container and We have these small collectible shoes here. Then we have the dial caliper micrometer, look to be new. Then we have the X-Acto knife set with box, appears to be new also. And then Mary Inglebright dolls or pin cushions. Then we have the Stimulax Oster massager. Let's go around here. Oh, almost forgot the driftwood with the birds. I think it's pretty cool. Look good in any yard. Then we have this cool antique mirror here. And it's from the 1900s. It's got a nice, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that, but it's got a nice hallmark on there. January 19th, 1900. And some nice cast iron pans. And then this is a Jim Shore lighthouse right there. And we do have the box. Some other lighthouse and leaded glass lighthouse that light up. Oh, and this is cool. Lay off this old man's private poison. Decanter, and then the stein, and then again, more lighthouses collection. And all have their original boxes. I'm gonna go slow so you can see, hopefully. And many are numbered, some are signed. 
And then we have this lighthouse pitcher. I like that. It's kind of cool. And Seattle World's Fair decanter here. Then uh, cast iron bird bath. It's pretty cute. And then we have this John Deere collection. It's got mugs and clock tractor, coasters, little garbage can here too. Neat collection. And then this vintage Olympia beer collection here. Very nice, very nice. Looks like some costume jewelry earrings with this cool tower. The tower is pretty neat. Then we have the seashells and others lot. Very nice. Some unique shells here and painted. We have a collection of old coasters. Some pocket games, some vintage pocket games here. Hours of fun. And we have this nice covered pan, stainless steel, some doilies, Toastmaster. Let's see, well, let's go around here. And then this is a Broyhill High Boy dresser. Very nice. Some vintage lamps. Then this is that Maida Tiffany leaded glass lamp with a bronze base. Heavy, heavy. And we have this panoramic photo of Fort something, I forget, in Alaska. And then, then we have this little tiered tower. It's pretty unique with these porcelain animal figurines. HP Office Jet 4500 wireless printer, Office Jet Pro 800 or 8100 wireless printer. And this lamp, I don't know, it's pretty cool. So, appears to be modern but very unique artsy we have this circleware serpendipity decanter vintage wooden handled flatware set and this is the cheese kit <laughs> cheese cutter kit <laughs> we have these beautiful crystal almost like brandy but wine glasses and then we have the Krups and um, Bodum, that's what it is. Bodum French Press. California Pottery Sectional Lazy Susan. And this is interesting. It's false graph. I haven't seen false graph figurine before. It's pretty cool. And it's got a water globe in there. And this pass through lamp. And then this large Jamestown China set. Very nice. We have some old LP records. And there's things like Elvis and Rick Nelson and there's a whole bunch in here. And you get the the case too. And I want to say this is that needle point. Yep, little case with needle point. And this is a German set, green and etched stemware. Then we have Mariner's baseballs. One is signed, I believe. Ken Griffey. Not sure which one, but that is in my description somewhere. Then we have some Mariner bobbleheads. Floor lamp. <clears throat> then we have this McDonald's collectible toys with this cool basket. Oh, and it's got a wooden handle. Very nifty. Old crate. And this mid-century glass front cabinet piece here. This wooden Pepsi crate. Oh, another one of mine. And <laughs> I'm going to buy this. KitchenAid mixer. Javalia coffee pot. Possibly mine, too. <laughs> this Fluval aquarium. Look, appears to be new. This Calflon 12-inch by 18-inch roasting pan with the original box. Oh, and this has the turkey lifters. Very nice. This electrified oil lamp. Very cool. Sony radio with remote. This cast iron doll bench. Little doll and chair. We have this metal or tin globe. Not sure of the brand. 
Coca-Cola Bear, this lighted vanity mirror, pedestal footstool. He's kind of cool. He's got feet and pants on. <laughs> And then we have lots of Beanie Babies. Beanie Babies, Beanie Babies. Look at all these Beanie Babies. Tons and tons of Beanie Babies. <laughs> if you ever needed a Beanie Baby, now is the time to get a Beanie Baby. I wonder how many times we can say Beanie Babies. And then we have some McDonald's Beanie Babies. <laughs> now we have the Honey Hill Bunch Club. And the Stainless Trash Can. And then we have this folding yoga mat, I want to say. And then we have this day bed, trundle bed. And it's got the pull-out bed underneath. It's a trundle with these porcelain, beautiful porcelain knobs, metal frame. And then we have this painted milk can. Very nice. Oh, and I love this, this tilt-top small table here. Very cool. And we have this colorful chair. Nice. Then we have these uh, bird houses. One's painted like a watermelon slice. It looks really cool. Then we have these Seattle Seahawks pennants and puzzle. Looks like there's a Sonics pennant in there also. And then Seattle Seahawks mugs and tumblers and drinking glasses. Washington State Cougars, pennants, and bears. And we have this gilded mirror here, very nice, ornately framed. Looks like a hand carved piece of barn wood with seagulls on it. Interesting. And we have these washboards. That one is soap and towel, five cents. That one's a cute little one there. This is kind of cool. It's like a little red cabinet washboard. Very nice. Double handy. And this is pretty cool too. It's like a carved with a hummingbird on a flower. It's pretty, pretty interesting. We have these very nice CD cases. Could be used for other things, displays, why not? And we're not sh too sure what this piece of cedar is here. It's some sort of shelf by Woodlore. And then this uh, media center. Cute little drawer nightstand, side table. And this circular pedestal table here with three legs. And let's see, let's take a look over here real quick. All right, let's go to the off catalog, good look. We have ties. Oh, and we have this Traveler Alcoholics Worldly Cane. Looks like it's been all over the place. Very cool. Backpack, we have tons of box lots just full of great everyday items I'm gonna kind of pan slow so everybody can kind of get a good look people have been wanting me to walk through here so there's just so much I it's too hard to do a, a description on all this stuff it's best if you come in and look poke and prod Oh, there's another coffee pot. I'm gonna buy one with that one. It crepes. Tons of great stuff. You never know what you're gonna find in these lots. I don't know what's in half of these lots, so. Just doing the little shimmy. <laughs> Trying not to shake the camera too much. 
Look at all this home decor, tools, kitchenware, seashells, office, Mariner's magazines. It's getting kind of dark over in this corner. I'm not sure how much you're going to be able to see. is why I recommend coming in. Well, I want to thank everybody for watching this video. If you like, please comment, share, hit the like button. All this great stuff. And we, I hope to see you at the auction. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.